In today's video, we'll be watching these mukbangers eating something I've never had before. I'm talking about cheesy animal fries. Animal. <laughs> That's animal fries. That's coming up right now on Calorific Tea. Veronica actually stopped uploading to her channel over two years ago. It was sad because she's one of the OGs in the whole mukbang community. I was excited to see that she finally uploaded a new video about a month ago. In this mukbang, she's eating homemade and very saucy animal fries. Doesn't it look good? Here goes. Mmm. Mm. I love poutine and I wonder if this is just as good. This is the first time I featured him on my channel and my gosh, he's hilarious. He's eating the real animal fries from In-N-Out Burgers. A lot of mukbangers will just make their own version of animal fries, probably because they live nowhere near an In-N-Out restaurant. This, however, is the real deal. I'm so jealous that he has an yeah. in and out nearby. I've heard their burgers are especially good. Did you know that animal fries are actually on a secret menu in in and out So they're not officially on the menu, which is just wild because they're so popular. She made a version of animal fries that looks really tasty and super saucy. She's using McDonald's fries too, which in my opinion are the best fries ever. You know I'm right. She used McDonald's fries, relish, Thousand Island dressing, cheese slices, and caramelized onions. Yum. This honestly looks delicious. She added the perfect ratio of everything on her animal fries. Do you guys like caramelized onions? I think they're so tasty. Monica made some animal fries that look extra cheesy and saucy. I love the big bites that she takes throughout her video. She's eating with her hands too, which is so messy, but at least she's eating with gloves on. Do 
you guys watch Monica? She seems pretty cool. I really like her setup. The camera is super close to the food, so you can just see everything. Nick Accato started making animal fries, then he just kept adding melted cheese and Cheetos on top and he didn't stop. I can't even see the fries anymore or the animal sauce. This is basically just cheese and Cheetos at this point. Oh, wow. Oh, looks amazing. I'm not sure if amazing is the right word for this, but it's definitely something. That might be the most calorically dense bite I've ever witnessed in my life. Mm. Mm. More. Mmm. That animal sauce is good. Wow, this has to be the cheesiest hot dog I've ever seen in my life. I know this video compilation is about mukbangers eating animal fries, but I had to include at least one bite of her eating this epic hot dog. She got the hot dog from 7-Eleven and her animal fries from In-N-Out. I can't even imagine the amount of calories this would be. <laughs> She put grilled onions and animal sauce on her cheesy hot dog to make it even more indulgent. I love how Twilight goes 100% in her mukbangs. You'll never see her skimping on the sauce or cheese ever. She's another mukbanger who's not scared of using a lot of sauce, and I mean a lot. It looks like she poured an entire bottle of Thousand Island dressing on top of her fries, along with a ton of melted cheese. Her fries are so soggy from all the sauce, they're kind of like mashed potatoes now. Have you guys ever made your own animal fries? If so, how did it turn out? <laughs> 